Loki. Whoa. The next one. Loki. Season yeah. two, We're episode two. Is... So episode yeah, 22. Episode two, E2. Wow. Those first 20 episodes, <laughs> they just flew by. Yeah, so I much happened. So much that. wonderful, to be, wonderful content. To be content. fair, when we get 20 episodes into the show, I don't, I'm not still not going to know what happened. A friend of mine was asking for context because he was going to watch season two without season one. And I was like, um... Why? <laughs> <laughs> Well, <laughs> it, it, but like seriously, what the fuck do you say? It's like the time team that Loki joins uh, and uh, becomes friendly cloud Loki. And there's uh, an evil cloud that's trying to destroy everything who gets killed. And now everything means anything. Purple fart monster. Like you forgot uh, about that. Yeah, that's right. Oh, I feel like throwing that in only body. complicates yeah, things. Right. <laughs> oh, he's yeah, he's essential. Then, yeah, <laughs> he's essential. Was an alligator. <laughs> What's up with that? Wow. Oh, yeah. The alligator. Okay. Yeah, you're right. Ignore the Lokis, man. Like, how do you even explain that first season? One I don't know how you would. Anyway, I don't know that anyone story. should. And I imagine yeah. that you get 10 people in a room who've all watched it and said they like it, and then ask them to relay the plot. I bet you get a lot of different answers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so many people what think it's like happened. a like a buddy cop uh, duo with him and like Owen Wilson, but I swear that happened for like an episode. And yeah, there's a lot more you know? of Loki and Sylvie together. Yeah, it was. And, uh, yeah, that's that was more. That's of a show. not as fun a dynamic. <laughs> Is there anything to say about that first episode? We well, I think we, we covered it, it last time. We liked a, a lot of things that for... were the packaging, so to speak. The uh, acting the... was good. Some of the humor actually hits. The sets are neat. There's some but neat to, visuals. Again, soundtrack is good. Soundtrack bring us back good. reality, though. The writing was crap. Yeah. The writing. With all that said, with all that said, we still have no idea. Yeah. The the writing is actually. Sometimes difficult to criticize too because we've got no foundations. I don't know where to yeah. begin. Um, the foundations are gone, as far as I'm concerned. They were already gone, probably by the end of like episode two of the first season, maybe yeah. even episode one. No, but especially episode one. with that whole idea of oh, this big machine has all of the timelines, the disparate timelines. They funnel into this to go back into the one timeline. It's like wow, that seems new and contradictory. But I don't even know what is or isn't oh, yeah. contradictory anymore. They've contradicted themselves so many times that I can't make sense of anything the, in this show the temporal yeah. lube that's lube. just something yeah. that's a yeah. thing it's just like okay <laughs> Weird that we never heard about this before. That existed I feel like last season. Pretty, uh... No, it's been here this whole time. It was just in this room. It was yeah, this whole sector right. with this yeah, guy you've yeah. never met before, but super important and friends with Mobius. You're like, okay, all right, sure, yeah. I feel like he would have come up, but no, no that's fine. No, mm -hmm. Oh, and then of course the whole thing of like, so the TVA does operate in time and space. I mean, we already knew that because time progresses forward. They have conversations. The <laughs> yeah, and they walk yeah, to places. They... The reason I was like a cartwork like that at the TVA is because I think uh, in season one it would have just been outright stated by somebody at some point that's just like well if, yeah because if you could go back in time in the tva you'd start like duplicating all over the place or like everything would fall apart and you're like oh yeah because it would have to like basically the tva is almost a concept that doesn't make sense in and of itself like you'd have to do a I, shit a ton of work time and space that it controls to be like time eternal space. robots that's what i'm saying you like know? beyond time and space but has a timeline and it's like and then occupy space so it's already fucked and it's like okay well how do yeah. i portray something that doesn't have time or space it's like and, well it's pretty and, fucking hard actually <laughs> like really that's why the, the only the premise... reason why the tva doesn't come across as cringe as like the crisis on infinite earths beyond time and space is really because of the production values. Yeah. <laughs> That's the reason. Sylvie? Where does she? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, will say, so if I was being pitched season two and they're like, Sylvie's at McDonald's, I'd be like, Are we we have ideas or are we fucking around? Because <laughs> we just, cause, I mean, if you want it. We're all variants. This changes everything. This changes nothing. Changes this nothing. Changes nothing. Changes, which is just oh, stupid, but that's fine. Aim, I don't even know what that, I don't, what I, you don't, oh. There's a variant. You're I'm away. Sylvie, and I'm going to McDonald's. You did. It's yeah. so funny if both Sylvie it's and Loki got shot by the back of the head, and the next episode they appeared, we, we would just be like, yeah, I guess. I just want you to be okay. Yeah, I'll be curious if they want to restart the romance element. That's going to be something else. We need to know what happened at the end of time. Find Sylvie. What happened? What, you're hating on the Scots now too, Rags? <laughs> no, just her. No. <laughs> just her. <laughs> no. Nay, no, I'd never do no, that. No, I no, ain't no, 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 no. <laughs> Why do they always tease me with those better characters in the beginning? They still, I think at this point, are like, remember, you did like some yep. of this. <laughs> so they get you to stick around so for the first two minutes. We could just go and watch those movies and forget yeah. about this. We could just, just leave. pause this. This is our job, but we, we could just do something else. <laughs> we could, you know, yeah. It might just be because I hate the MCU now, but I kind of miss the old faster intro. Yeah, I miss the I miss the flickering yeah, yeah. comics. I thought that was really cool. Uh, was cool this one's yeah. Infinity War had the best one. Very beginning, but then it gets replaced with all that stuff. 
Sylvie's not here. We just got here. Oh, back yeah, on London. Earth again? Wow, yeah, London, London wow. and UK. It's London. That is, that is pretty funny. London, just in case you didn't know, it's it's in England. Yeah, I mean, mostly everything does that, but still, I agree. Well, it's just that the, the meme is typically that when it's in America, they'll put the city and then the state. But when it's a different country, it'll be the country. Would you, uh, for any, if you had full control, not allow them to put London, England there and instead wait for a character to reference it or have someone in the background have it? Uh, can pick it up? I think at this point, I really would prefer to yeah, not do, do the text on screen that says I would way prefer are. that we pick it up from the accents and then the, yeah. you know, just casual yeah. talks about different things culturally. Yeah. It'd be cool. E even Give you a little mystery for a second. Um, and something the they 70s figure out. are really yellow. Even just second yeah. unit photography of yeah. just a skyline with no text on screen, yeah. I would prefer, even though I think you can do better than that, too. Wait, so he's that's the real life of Security Man from Earth, where he got snatched from, right. I guess, right? Mobius! Whoa! Nice to see him. <laughs> but he knows him. No, I used to work with this guy. Wait, now I'm confused. I don't know well, what's going on. Apparently, he's some kind of undercover agent, I think they said earlier. X5 is an actor now. Or he's undercover. Wait, so is he TVA undercover right now? We could all use a drink, right? What are you drinking? Surprise me. How about you? Oh, I'm fine. Oh, fuck off. Loki would have something to It's drink. so annoying, isn't yeah. it? It's too late as well. It's not even about whether or not they understand original Loki. They don't care about original Loki now because yeah. he's, not, he's not original Loki anymore. He's improved also, Loki. Just this also, guy. Lol, we're just gonna Whoa, what go. the fuck? Oh, it's TVA lady. Okay. What? Wait, so they're trying to capture him? Yeah, I, I okay. feel like I missed an episode. I'm, I feel like... like I, <laughs> yeah, what is going on here? Let him go because they want to have drinks. Brad? Brad? Oh, by the way, you want to talk about like... Because I think this said sacred timeline, so this is meant to be mainline MCU timeline, so... Well, can there's they only one timeline what? now, right? Can they change? No, there's that. No, that's the multiverse. Oh, is it all the? Okay, it all the... diverged. Yeah. Instead of... Did he just use magic for the first time in forever? I like it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's what it looked like. You'd forget he's a god, by the way. Yeah. You, you would forget that. Yeah. I yeah. hate this yeah. show so yeah. much for that. Like, where was this last episode? You arguably yeah. helped. Where was him this demeanor? Further away. Yeah. Use the use magic again. Ma I was about to say. Again. Did you use just with? <laughs> Uh, Loki can he outrun pushed him him further, and then now he's chasing him. He's an Loki Asgardian god. Look at him. these yeah. little Dude, steps. How are you not getting no. Without his Captain magic, America Tom Hiddleston would be Loki. Him. How is this happening? You had you were like two meters away the whole time. <laughs> what the hell? This is Leia and Kenobi all over again. Like this is bullshit. <laughs> how are you perpetually like, the exact him. distance away? Really what is this? Did you really think you could outrun me? I mean, it looked like it. Yeah. Good. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh, well. We should have started with that. Why didn't he do that? Oh, uh, yeah, this is... Wait, what was that? We're like two minutes in and it's retarded. Literally, already. Loki could, now... like, shout a word and make him appear and it would just be like, yeah, that's how that works. But no, I guess he's lost him. Oh. Oh. So that's just like a teleportation a device then. Yeah. Which I guess sure. is really useful. You want to have that handy. This show is just so coherent. Where's the rude boy off to? I'm not rude. Oh, did you lose your tickets to the opera, did you? I thought he was famous. I guess yeah, the, that's why they don't like him. He's he's high class, they're low class. Fuck this guy. Hold on a second, all right? Hold on. Back Why do teleport, this man? instead of the teleporter, my bro? Press <laughs> like, your button. All you're gonna do is antagonize all these people. Oh, it's Loki fucking gonna... with him. So unsophisticated, X5. But now oh, you've revealed so, it, so okay, he can just run. He actually used his power. But he's just revealed nice. it, so he'll just run away. Real cute. Real cute. Oh, Wait, you did that? Frozen. They're all frozen. Oh, you have telekinesis. Oh, I forgot you had telekinesis that you should have been using this whole time, but okay, that's fine. So now, are you just sick of running madly after him, and so you're not going to use your many powers? That you're actually going to do the thing show that Loki now, like... would do and mess with someone? Oh, look at that. Hey, well, there we you go. you remember Bye. the helmet with the horns? The shadows oh, the are grabbing him. him. Waldron wouldn't do this. It's still, it, it, I was about to say, it doesn't feel at all like he would do it, but it's also like them remembering things that Loki could do. For a second, I'm just like, I wait know, a minute. We have to catch up, it, make up yeah, for lost time. I feel like we're being teased with the original Loki, where it's mm -hmm. like, You can't do her. it anymore. This Loki mm -hmm. isn't the same Loki anymore, you yeah. know? God, it's been, like, that was actually just like an inch of something. That was like Seriously, in the wrong just place. Just to see him have and some agency for a in second. the wrong place. That's the name of the show. <laughs> I feel like I missed some dialogue at the beginning there. Like I'm, I'm not entirely sure why we're capturing that guy again. No? I, maybe we'll find out over the course of the episode. What is this? That's a temp pad. What did you do to it? I put some colorful buttons on it for you. <laughs> he's snarky. Mm -hmm. I like it. Well, it says C C C. So it's a piece super of secret cell. What about this? Have Obi check it out. See, have Obi check that. It's like, Obi's our tech guy now. He'll be involved all the time, even though he wasn't at all in season one. <laughs> at least we'll have me. a fun actor. 
so that's something. No, just yeah, that's that's get. genuinely just, true. Just Actually, we very much enjoyed any scene with these three in it. Oh, I think good? I'd rather see a show I like, of what um, OB's getting up to in his little, uh, you know, in his little workshop. I like uh, Owen Wilson in this. I think he's alright. Do you think this is a higher priority than preventing a temporal meltdown? Oh, no, 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 no. I, I, I stay focused on the temporal meltdown. I agree. Seems prudent. Oh, I thought he was making fun of them. I didn't realize he was asking genuinely. I was also kind of hoping that he'd be like, yeah, I'll take care of your random small problem while I'm trying to save the universe. Any hits on Renslayer's temp pad? No hits, but I did find something else. This is the only person who works at the TVA. <laughs> yeah. Who is this guy? Does he know the producer or something? Section 42 should match with the system. Well, is that with the red light? Because we tried that already. We'll try it again. Is this Mobius' office? Yep. I thought it was yeah. Loki's. Remember he had like a desk in season one? It looks kind of like that one. Yeah, that was his What's his he office? writing up there on those uh, on those windows? Windows? It's yeah, little, I guess they're windows. The little graphs and stuff. The perfect yeah. microwave popcorn algorithm. Miss Minutes is helping Renslayer. So she isn't married, that is confirmed. When I was in the past, I heard something, an old conversation between Renslayer and He Who Remains. Do they not know he's called Kang yet? It's like, just say no. Kang. He Who Remains is cringe. Yep. It takes too long. Well, yeah. Kang is cringe too, but it's implied <laughs> from the name. It's just a, a rigged temp pad. X5 says it somehow blocks TVA tracking. That's not what it does. Oh, he knows. I okay. looked at it from a distance, I know what it is. Haven't you read the TVA guidebook? I haven't memorized it. I feel like Mobius would have memorized it. <laughs> I would have thought all of them did. What else do they do with yeah. their lives? This definitely doesn't block any trackers, that's for sure. Whoa. Let's take a run at Brad Wolf. What was that weird... I don't, yeah, I don't what know. That? I, 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 genuinely, <laughs> Rags, I feel like it felt like a video game, like you achieve an unlock, chapter complete, yeah. or whatever. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Like that's definitely an achievement unlock. While the, it just coincidentally lines up with his yeah, movement. Brad's an asshole, so don't let him get under your skin. Why is this chick in a, is so involved in everything? Who is she like in this organization? I thought she was just she a was, guard. She's just the, a security person. Well, she was one of the guards yeah. that turned earlier than the others in the first season, but I don't see she's why she's season. here really. What did you do to this temp pad? It blocks your trackers. No, it doesn't. What is it designed for, X5? It's Brad. I'd probably call him Brad just to make him feel I'd better probably, about it. Because yeah. <laughs> yeah. I want other well, information. Calling someone X5, calling well, someone X5 is cringe. Especially considering that this lady believes that the TBA is bullshit. Why would she still be calling people by is the name? Yeah, that's version of that the person that, is that she hates. Very true. That's uh, yeah, it should bother funny. her to refer to people by labels exactly. like that. Exactly. Everyone here knows what you're doing. You know, you're just trying to make up. Oh, we doing this? All right, this all is right. theme, isn't it? That's what, that's what we're up to, huh? For all the terrible, awful shit you've done in your life, you pathetic little man. Look at what you got to Loki. Holy shit! It's riveting. Keep going. I want to hear more. Oh god, it should be water off a duck's back with him. Yeah, he should hear that and go, Quack, 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 smirk. <laughs> Problem is, you think you're special, but you're not. Oh my god. He's pretty special, for you. His <laughs> pretty special yeah. Goals. He's an ice he giant so raised by yeah. Odin who can cast spells. I feel like that's special. At the end of the day, you just make everything worse. Oh. I like how this is just coming from some guy Who the fuck Brad. are you? <laughs> Brad, yeah. <laughs> For your mother. Did you just say for your it's mother? You lose. You're a loser. Loki. This is just what the writers think of him. Wow, yeah. that's getting him, he's getting big mad. Well, I mean, yeah, mentioning his mum would get him real mad. That's actually true. But why the fuck would this guy be mentioning it? <laughs> is he gonna punch him? There is the laugh. Hold him you back, Mobius. Loki. Hold him back. Thank you, Brad. You gonna cry? You gonna piss and shit? I have done some terrible, awful things. Yeah, maybe that is who I am. It's the, real me. <laughs> like... it's the real me. A loser. Oh. Perhaps I've just been biding my time. God, I wish. Imagine, <laughs> it, imagine it was all a fucking show. That'd be wonderful. Oh, I would fucking love if this show was all a show. So I can do terrible, awful things to you. Do you remember he was actually specific in Avengers? They did just say terrible, awful things. Where is Sylvie? When everyone leans in like that, call their bluff. Don't move. If they want to kiss you, let them. <laughs> yeah, let them. <laughs> You're way too obsessed with her. Also, that's true. You are way too yeah. obsessed with her. Yeah, you knew her for like an hour, dude. Yeah, he's holding it back. Go, Mobius. I got a little tense. No, it's, you can't point it out, too. It makes it worse. Play along with us, answer our questions, and we get you Just back. get on with it. Torture him. You could be an actor. I'm not an actor. I'm an analyst, but thank you. You're not an analyst. I'm not a hunter. Well, I mean, he is an analyst because he's been doing it for a while. You even, know, even if he's unaware he's of the truer context, he's still exactly. an analyst. The TVA is not your real home. Mobius 
isn't even your real name. Who, uh, who is this guy? <laughs> He's, Brad. He's, Brad. He's Brad. He has all the answers. Do you have any idea what kind of life you might have left behind? Who might be waiting for you back there? I mean, do you care? Where, 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 I'm sorry, where were these questions in episode one? Oh, no. Where were these questions right after this all happened between Loki and the main characters? You're just a nowhere man. You're a, You're a nowhere man. You're a silly little man. Silly little, Silly little, little man. Was... This is annoying me because all of this stuff should have been discussed by all the main characters by now. <laughs> he just slapped them. I can't believe like it's brought up by fucking Brad. Brad. By Brad. And Brad this is the guy. one who managed to get a rise out of both of them, you know? Yeah. 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 Brad. That's they the most Mobius has lost his temper. Like, he got pruned and he wasn't even that angry, but Brad yeah. somehow gets under his skin. <laughs> they should be having questions like, even if you lived a fake life the whole time, is there meaning in the fake life if you thought it was real the whole time? Mm, there's but things no. to explore. Where are we? I was following you. No, I was following you. One of you was in front of the other. Mobius, you were clearly ahead of me. Have I slice of pie? I thought they were gonna make another joke there. I was waiting for it, but I guess we gave up on it. Oh, they're gonna sit down and have a pie yeah, and talk pies, about their man. lives? Oh, I'm Computer. key lime pie. Does anyone remember that from Dexter? Anyone? No. I didn't watch Dexter, I'm so sorry. Oh, oh wow, it's just a pie room. <laughs> yeah, it's a pie room. It's the key lime pie room, a room for key. See, this is wouldn't it have been Why neat? Would you have an entire room dedicated to key lime pies, especially when they're stored in such an inefficient way. How do you know? It could be magic. Well, if you have magic, then surely you could do better than this. <laughs> I'm just imagining now that there's someone in the TBA who just, his job is, I make pies. That's me. But now if I want to eat pie with someone else and we don't want to have the same kind of pie, we have to like I gotta go to, go to different <laughs> places <laughs> and get our pies. No, it won't taste right in here. Else. Wait, he's talking about Avengers. Wait, what's he, going he, on? He just said that you got so angry to hit him. I've been angry before. I did that whole thing in Avengers. That's so fucking lame. I was so angry with my father and my brother. I held the whole of New York City hostage with an alien army. <laughs> <laughs> they just need him to uh. pussyfy everything he's ever done. I just don't know why that's- No, I mean, that is on brand. They do that with basically all their characters at this point. And any of them yeah. with a long history, we're like, well, let's ruin it by making Half fun of it. it or ignoring it. Does the pie room need salt and pepper shakers? <laughs> hey, op optional, you know? Don't you want to see the life you're supposed to live before they kidnapped you and brought you into the TV? Why wasn't this the first scene of season two? Fuck it. Be bold. Uh, it's too. It's too chill. Be bold. Too, Have uh, them both discussing I, the realities of season one with a pie. The TVA is the only life I've ever known. I like it. Seriously, unbelievable that we're doing this now, but I guess mm. better than better than never. We could explore that Mobius like legitimately doesn't care about some past life he doesn't even remember in every yeah. part of it. He's like, no, like my life is here. I like it here. That's an old thing that I just don't. I just don't even care to know. He's definitely the most interesting character. They could just open up old wounds, or it's something I can't go back to, or like, why bother? I just. Oh yeah, forward. and it could turn out that he did know about it. He has checked it, yeah, and he did not enjoy what he saw, sort of thing. X Five is going to talk. We just have to find the way in. All right. So what aren't we asking this time? No, you get it. You start poking him, and then you you see if that works, and then you start. Job. Putting things under his fingernails and then you just work up from there. Mm -hmm. X5 is a good hunter. So does it really make sense that he could spend all that time down there and not find Sylvie? What Mobius just said was absurd. It's like, yeah, he's a really good hunter. He couldn't have spent that much time on Earth and not found Sylvie. It's like, yeah, he could. Do you know how big Earth is? <laughs> it's it's big. Place. It's Earth jungle. Is it like a Star Wars planet where everyone meets at one spot of it? <laughs> For one and room. This is, again, presuming one that village, Sylvie one was on Earth in this timeline of yeah. all of the timelines in this uh, multiverse. He's the only one who knows where Sylvie is. Uh, what? Okay. Why does he think that? Just gotta make him talk. Well, come on, you're the god of mischief, right? Oh god, are we gonna oh. do... Wait, we can finally reference it. We're gonna do Soba, maybe convince him he's talking to a friend by Loki's oh. illusions. <laughs> can you imagine they were like, let's copy his brain into a disc and simulate all the ways we could possibly do <laughs> I just like the the amount of work that went into the sets for the show really neat. Yeah. I mean, it's probably the best looking Marvel production since like in, you know. I have a feeling super refreshing. The, this was the last one that they're putting that kind of effort into because it was successful. The others they're sort of like thrown out quick. Yeah. But... I, yeah, but it's it's weird, isn't it? Because this show is this one way more expensive than the other ones. I mean, Secret Invasion cost over two hundred million dollars. Yes, I don't I know if it's the money. It's just the and approach. That was just like places. about the approach. Those were, real sets, those were just like houses. Hire the right people and give them the right amount of time, I guess. In those yeah. respects, anyway. I guess. Yeah, yeah. yeah this, look, this looks like effort. Back your head. Not specifically budget. Like I, this definitely seems well, like they had a great. Right. Yeah, <laughs> sleeping on a yeah, great is ironically not great. Yeah, but Brad can handle it. Hello, Loki. 
I'm ready for round two. Something I was curious about is, is he allowed to hurt Brad? And if so, yeah, we would have gotten our answers real quick if we had original yeah, Loki. Torture. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, I thought that was a Torture device, door yay. It's actually, oh, it's a vacuum cleaner. It's gonna suck off his dick. I'm glad they did that. That's a good joke, though. I'd be <laughs> careful about that because just from that alone, then I'm like, okay, so the scene we're doing isn't going to be a serious like torture thing. It's going to be a funny thing. No. <laughs> he can just run out the door. <laughs> he can just leave. <laughs> the door's yeah, there's close, close <laughs> yeah. the fucking door. And I guess... I'll take my chances with those two mooks <laughs> out there. Yeah, man. Yeah. Well, he's got that neck brace on. That means they can they can neck. zap him back. This is cute. Which one of you came up with this little script? Because you're a tough nut to crack. Yeah, you're so tough. You're so tough enough to crack because last time we asked you and you didn't tell us. Yeah, that was know. really made you tough. <laughs> yeah, you're a really tough nut. You know, like when your parents are like, where did you go? Uh, why, why were you late coming home? And you say, I'm not going to tell you. And your parents are like, oh, our son's a really tough nut to crack. And then they hit you with a hammer and you're like, okay, I'll tell you. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, I, I was at Brad's. Jesus Christ. Hey, open up. Oh, wait, Loki's going off. This is script. part of the plan, I have a feeling. Well, yeah. this is part of it? Yeah, that's right. They're doing the ruse. Hey! You sniffed us out, Brad. I would even prefer to go the route of Brad figures that out. He's like, do you really think yeah, I... like?" Yeah. And, then, and then Loki says, yeah, I kind of thought you would figure it out. And then actually tortures him. And then Mobius is like, no, 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 no. Get out of the balls for that, Muller. Do the double, triple cross. Come on. It's kind of... Isn't it weird that, like... You can lock someone out of getting into yeah. the room. Yeah, that's dumb as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Unless, of course, you can't and that it's all a ruse. From uh... I would, I imagine this is a ruse. Oh, it has to be. But what I'm, I guess I'm saying, does Brad think that any of this makes sense? Just logistically. I'm not trying to be a hero, Brad. I'm a villain. Oh, you're not a villain. Stop it. Is that the vacuum from Teletubbies? It does look like the... <laughs> What's it called? The machine that makes the milkshake or whatever the fuck it's called? I said some really hurtful things and I brought up your mother. I don't even know. It doesn't even look intimidating. It looks like an appliance. Well, it's supposed to be funny. It, it does look it like, looks like it cleans rugs. Like I said, it's supposed to be funny, so they're going to have to really work hard if they want to go serious. You can just push it over. It looks like it would break. What? Don't just touch random buttons on that, okay? Mobius, get would in Would really here. prefer it if uh, Brad was just like, do whatever. Don't give a shit. Turn it off. What if Brad's like, I know you're not gonna kill me. Well, yeah, kill me and you don't get your information, so. I don't know where Docs and the others are, okay? I don't know. Brad, they're obviously not gonna kill you. I've done some terrible, awful things. You keep saying this. I, I mean, this, uh, this like insecurity <laughs> on the part of the right. And yeah. I wonder if a payoff for this will be like, wow, it felt like the real Loki in there, the villainous, and then you'll get like an expression from Loki where he's like, yeah. Maybe. Because um, remember, this, this season's is like, about Loki finding himself. I swear, I don't know where they are. I want to believe you, but you're just, you're such a good actor. This is like the real Loki doing a cosplay of the old Loki. That's what it feels like. It's just like. I want to see Zaniac. I want to see the Marvel writings version of a bad show when all they make is bad shows when they try. Maybe that's the key. I was supposed to go look for Sylvie, but then I, I, I bailed, okay? I bailed. This isn't even particularly that intense on part of the audience members i think like seeing because i just don't believe you'll ever crush him i just don't believe it yeah the way you can kind of fix he, that is uh use height or something well imagine he'd crushed his hand you put a box mm. around it and just crushed it it'd be fucking horrifying yeah, start with that start with that so we can take it seriously just tell me where sylvie is right she has a new life well she i guess now you can McDonald's stop back before it turned shitty i like how you let him go and he hadn't got the information yet oh there you go Got there in the end. Like, is that it, show? That's all you got? Yeah. That's the teeth? That's you said you bailed on the mission. Yeah, but I found her first. She's on a branch. And the branch is on a limb, and the limb on a tree, and a tree, and a... It was all a part of the plan, haha. <laughs> yeah. but, but then they'll have that line, like I said, it's like, I really was convinced for a second that you might kill him, Loki, and then Loki will be like, huh, yeah. Wow, they, uh -huh. they fooled Brad, but they didn't fool the five of us watching the show. <laughs> the, yeah. the truth is, Mobius, I did let a little of my old self out there. Please Brad don't. Watch many TV shows, Why is I guess. Casey the only fucking person who works in this organization? I don't know. Oh, hey, nice to meet you. 
We're all gonna die. It's funny. We're all gonna die. <laughs> the um, bad cop going off the rails, but it actually was on the rails the whole time. It's just something that so many shows have done, and to the point where it's even boring if you do flip it, and he does go further off the rails than off the rails. Yeah, plan. even that is kind of you know. Yeah. I probably would have preferred like he Loki punching him and Mobius being like, "Oh, d yeah, okay, I guess we have to." I don't believe like... the TVA handbook is that small, by the way. Yeah. It looks like it's yeah. only like 50, 60 also, pages. Also, Boris is a dumb fucking name. Yeah, look at how small that is. Maybe the oh, font the, is really the, small. The writing is really space. small, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, really, it's single-spaced. The containment doors are locked, so without Miss Minister to help us override the lock, we're stuck. Can you use a so large well, gun? Yeah. Or can you melt it with a dark saber? Or a prune gun, you know, the thing that melts everything. Can you put the door in one of those boxes? No. And squeeze it down and crush it. I'll build the device, but you need to find a way in or it won't matter. Okay. McDonald's. Oh, so that's their side quest then. Yeah, see, they did the thing. Look, it's Oklahoma, not America. Because you know that Oklahoma's in America, but you don't know that London is in <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> that's so, yeah, you're right. Like, you're right. You called that perfectly. There's so many things that do that. It's I don't get it. Yeah, because it should have just said Oklahoma, America, which would be yeah. like... Okay. Or, I feel like I'm uh, gonna start noticing that. America. Yeah, that a nice truck. That is a nice truck. It's like, why would you even need it? You got an American flag there, you got a Ford there, you got a McDonald's in the 70s. Yeah, it's pretty you know blatant, I mean? you know. You can figure it out. Yeah, that I was about to say, sorry, that, was a, that is no, an look, American flag. Yeah, right you're right. <laughs> so, yeah, this you can I mean, probably figure all this out, you know? I think it's dumb as fuck to, little, to know, have the right initial shots us. being an American flag in there and you, you need to tell people that's that's too much. Come on. Even if it takes you 30 seconds to figure it out, that's more enjoyable than just having it straight up told to you. And let's be honest, if you didn't figure it out is anything that what do you lose? Bad? yeah like are you okay it just works here now okay oh god i, I can't even express how much yeah, i don't well, care yeah no, I, I don't, don't yeah. i don't give a shit it's a little it's unfortunate really... because i'm more than happy to just pick apart what's going on with these three and ob and stuff but with just her i'm like here we OB. go this is like the alice segments on batwoman when i just wanna she's nuts yeah. and amazing yeah. and i don't the care for ahsoka where i'm just like as soon as she's on screen i'm like fuck god they're treating this like it's so deep <laughs> Wow. I don't care! Wow, oh my goodness, oh my gosh. Can you believe it? They're reunited after all this time. After Hi. what, like a week I'll have maybe? a number two, oh, no pickles, <laughs> medium fry, and a medium mm. Coke. Listen, I haven't got all day. Are you gonna order something? Oh, are they memeing? What? Can we talk? My break's in five minutes. Oh, for a second there, I thought they were gonna be like, she's, um, she doesn't remember yeah, him or something. Yeah, convenient timing. Imagine if she said, yeah, my please break's don't waste in like our time three hours. <laughs> A short break, so talk fast. She's still a bitch. Doesn't matter. Yeah. What yeah. <laughs> Doesn't matter what dimensional universe. <laughs> Do you sit on your coat like that, you fucking barbarian? Yeah. Pull that up, like fix it. Nobody sits on the coat Jeez. like that. Yeah, it makes it awkward to like I... lean. Yeah, to lean or move. It's, yeah. You know, plus it gets it all your like you're just like it's like pressing dirt and grime into and it's, your jacket. It can damage it too. You gotta be careful. <sighs> I, uh... Get on with it! No, you gotta wait. I haven't come here to make trouble. Then why are you here? Oh, but I don't know. Trouble. Because you're at McDonald's? Okay. <laughs> That's fucking yeah. strange. Do you understand what you did? You created the multiverse, Sylvie. I've been pulled through time between the past and the present. I feel like that's not even the first thing to talk about. It really is the multiverse right. part. I'll just get to the point, Loki. Sylvie, I was in the future, and I saw you. Does that matter? That and could have been anything. you were Burger King. The TVA is in danger, and you were there. I need to know why. So you see the future now? Cool. God, I hate her so much. As much as I'd love to see the TVA burnt to the ground, I have no intention of going back there. I'm happy at McDonald's. Leave me alone. She's going to reject the call to adventure. What, this is her hero's journey, is it? I'm Fucking probably. Job. It's the future, it's going to happen. Is it? That sounds a lot like the future's already been written. And we both know that it hasn't, not anymore. Do you? <laughs> like, how do you know? If you and I don't work together on this, I can't guarantee oh, you that you're alone. Oh, you coming here with your TVA no. bullshit. Man, she's just so likable. Remember when you stabbed the guy in the castle and it made things happen <laughs> that we don't even know? You, you stabbed the magical cloud wise? in the space castle. <laughs> it did things. It, things and have it happened. made the time go all floompy and now the world might end or something and it might be because of you. You can't just run away to McDonald's. I thought you were setting us up for an ambush. Hell, you were just setting us up for a great meal. That feels, uh... Feels a bit product placement-y, doesn't it? He's setting us uh -huh. up for a great meal. Well, I, I thought the, the joke is that, wow, McDonald's used to not be shit. Oh, I, they can't do that, though, because the sponsorship. Apple pies were, were delicious. <laughs> no, like, they, they for real, they wouldn't be able to have that line and get the sponsorship. They probably wouldn't. They'd be like, man, McDonald's, it's been as amazing in the 70s as it is now, you know? Woo-hoo. Wow. I All sure do love 70s, my McDonald's. 50,000 locations today. worldwide or something. <laughs> 40 billion yeah. customers but, uh, served. But, but, but. And now here we are. 
Enjoying a meal like gentlemen. Gentlemen don't eat at McDonald's. Well, I guess those guys in the back look like gentlemen. Oh, it's the Hamburglar. Look at him over there. Great guy. Stealing people's hamburgers. Gives them to the Hamburglers. They, have, they, they even was have he, the tree. Was he around in the 70s, or did he get made like, later? I think it took a lot of time to create such an in-depth character. Like, they had to really focus. <laughs> what happened to those guys? They don't use them anymore. The McDonald's family? I think a lot of them died. Mm -hmm. They got old, man. <laughs> Is this a setup? Hey. What's going on? I'm drinking my, oh my water. God. What a twist. He led them here on purpose to get them in trouble or something. You know, you think the other the other TVA be... guys are going to come in here? He gave them maybe. a signal. And now they... Or that Wrench player, movie. maybe she'll show up to get both yeah. of them. Zaniac's getting a sequel. And you're both invited. Hey! I would like to see Zaniac and Zaniac too. We can wait all day. No, we can't. We need to talk about this back at the TVA. I thought your break was five minutes, Sylvie. Get your ass back in there. I mean, we're getting closer and closer to the end of the episode. Is something big going to happen yeah, finally? Something has to happen. We are all going to die. Oh, is this like an apocalyptic event area or something? This is gone. Unless we... For Sylvie? Oh, no, she does it. Okay. Why didn't Loki do this? Because he sucks. I can't remember. Is that a Loki? But I seriously have no fucking references they're anymore. Gonna, they're gonna bomb every branch. Yeah, including this one. How how could they blow up every single branch? Aren't there like countless? B15 incoming. Oh, look, she had oh, nanotech. Oh, okay. She's oh, a yeah. nanotech. Okay. I don't even think it's nanotech. I think it's wizard tech no, or whatever the fuck. No, it's, it's, it's nanotech. It's nanotech. No. It's, even if it's wizard tech, it's nanotech, all right? It's the same idea. It's the same principle. Well, you just mean CG suits. Yeah, Basically, she has that because yeah. of her wizardriness, which to be fair, Loki. <laughs> had that and i'm That's fine with true. that illusions That's but true. but and she's like female loki right that's like a power set but also other stuff because oh, she learned no, magic and shit him, sure. oh There's i guess we get to no... have our action scene then what are they doing with all the time doors looks like they're connected to the templates maybe that's why brats was modified god i don't care at all this all well, means like, nothing to me even, this doesn't solve any problems right they've pruned 30 percent of the branches this doesn't they've pruned 30 percent of the branch 30 percent of infinity how do you prune infinite branches and also that's like trillions of but dead. it's and it's really hard to but actually this, express. It's like trillions upon trillions upon trillions upon trillions infinitum. Like, like it, it never stops. Yeah. Loki, this use your fucking magic or get off the screen, man. Tired of watching Loki. Why isn't Loki, Loki yeah, spawning like a million Lokis? You just, just fight the things, things through. If How you it, want to prune the time anyway. it takes to prune a timeline, a billion, 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 billion infinity have been made. Yeah, I just exactly. don't understand how this could possibly have. But they can't. Even if they prune all of them, there'll still be new ones because that's like the, the nature idea of what's now. happening. Yeah. yeah. The TVA you have no the music. Yeah, what's with this music? So epic, like this season eight finale. Like, yeah. we've been waiting 10 years for this shit. You see that? That was so stupid. Yeah, he just threw it and pruned the game. Yeah. Where does he go? So he, Where he do they to go? The planet. Uh, don't overthink it. What? Oh, don't you dare pose. Huh? What, oh, okay. what did you just do? What oh, is that? Who knows? Ones. Is there a mana class? Like, who knows? It's I like just, how she this said, is like when you build up don't overthink it. To use like, your ultimate. Don't but overthink it. Oh, oh, because they were holding it. hands. Oh, we got her, I guess. There we go. If it worked it, that way, that, at least that'd be cool to know, but we just have no idea anytime they do magic. Isn't that so strange the way that that played out? Because technically, what happened there is they saved, like, almost, you know, basically countless lives. But you wouldn't think that that's what actually happened in that scene, because it played out so quickly and undramatically. Yeah, what are we- what's- what's happened? What are they looking at? Like, is, what's happened to the timelines? I have no idea there. what the reveal will be, it could be anything. They've all- they're all oh, un- no. un- the timelines are coming back. How? Those are people. Yes, they are. Oh, oh my shut, God. Yeah, yeah. The tr yes. they're accountable. They were always people. people. That's, it was they always were always was. people. Thank you. Always. I, I can't, but like season one is fucking blushing right now in terms of like, shut up. <laughs> like, yeah. we, we didn't want to acknowledge a lot of the other shit. This is how it's always been. This is what you've been doing since. It's always. unreal. They're supposed to be people, but they didn't realize until they realized or whatever. So yeah. for sure. <laughs> to, this is, to kill a big revelation. timeline isn't just to kill everyone that's alive. It's to kill everyone who was ever alive in that time. Timeline. Oh, they got it now, I guess. I also just, how is the sacred timeline looking like that? How is that possible? How is it that they were able to, with that few people, destroy that many timelines? Did you see there was like one branch? It's like, why is there so a wait, bazillion so does branches? That mean that there's many multiverses that are being destroyed. Is Andrew Garfield okay? So is this the best you lot can do? There was nothing we could do. Some defense. Shut you, up. You Fuck killed off. the man in the castle. The TVA is the problem. It's broken. It's rotten. Ooh, go You're away. rotten. I'm going home. If it's still there. Please don't. It's harder. 
I, I oh, wish she's gone for a while. Fuck her. Oh, God, you say that. Forever. I feel like she'll be back beginning of next yeah, episode. Oh, yeah, of course. This is but what hey, I say the about the MCU being like the nightmare dimension when it comes to like franchises and stuff. Look at how casually they just erased countless trillions of people. And surely this significant event will be registered in other you know, projects. Nope. Because, I mean, it's not it? like the TBI are the only people paying attention to the multiverse at this point. It's so weird to have them actually acknowledge the reality of the situation for once. I feel like what's happening. I'm when confused. they never did yeah. that. They never did that in season one. Hey, Sylvie. You okay? Just want to check. He seems like a nice fellow. Maybe he'll be killed horribly or he's evil. Is your mom on her way to pick you up? <laughs> yeah. Uh, she'll be here. As long as the meth ain't set in. No, go back to Chuck. I want to see how his, his oh, mom no. shows up to pick him up. Adventure is calling. Uh, she can't refuse the hero's journey forever. Because she is a hero, as we know. A piece of shit is what she is. Why didn't you to attach yourself to Sylvie in any way? Revo was retarded, but at least you, they attempted something with Revo. Yeah, it's you knew just, you yeah. knew what their plan was. It was just so bad. This is just... Yeah. <laughs> well, maybe it does stem from the fact that they, they want this to like be a show stuff. that goes for multiple seasons, but they have no plan because the yeah. MCU doesn't really have a comprehensive plan. At least I don't see how it could at this point. I always oh, love the yeah. uh, the oh, insane yeah. list of producers, executive producers, and co-executive producers. Tommy <laughs> Turtle? Yep. That guy's name was Tommy Turtle. Tommy good name. Turtle. Good name. <laughs> what, a, guy, what a Chad. How can you make anything of quality show, but you know, when you got like a million been. producers like that, man. Like I always just go back to like ordering a there pizza with four people is tough enough. Look oh shit, go. you're right. Tommy yeah. Turtle. There he is, Tommy Turtle. I'm just trying to figure, I don't There's so little to speculate on too. It's like, what's going to happen next? It's like, I don't fucking know. I don't know anything I don't know. they want. I mean, apparently we, we fixed the whole problem with Loki teleporting around, but now we need to fix the temporal loom, but the door is closed mean, surely... because it, it's only getting opened by the aura of the guy who built it, which is Kang, who's dead. So, uh, but that temporal loom problem, right? That's been like delayed significantly because of all the timelines that got I mean, obliterated. It has to be, right? I mean, that was the problem. There was too many of those branches and now they nuked a lot of them. Yeah, <laughs> but the problem is, I think they're going to basically forget about this massive, basically infinity war level, uh, mm. like consequence. Next episode will basically be like, it didn't happen. They'll just move on as normal. That's the routine. I don't know, I don't know how you do stakes with this kind of show, but they're not even trying. No, yeah. they've given up on that a long time ago. So yeah, and this you, Brad you guy, know. he just... He was oh, one of the people. He, he was, it's I guess, dude. one of the TVA guys who was hunting for Sylvie, and he found her. But then he was like, "Nah, went to make movies." Okay. Yeah, and, and even when you guys were saying about the um the black lady of like she should feel a certain way about this because of the revelation in the first one, is that even the same version of that character? Or didn't I Loki think so? Like, Loki, I have no idea. Loki explained have... what happened to them both, right? That everything is fake and that the TVA are people take like that's all big revelations. But like we have this is what I mean about the fact that Brad brought it up to like torture these characters when it's like where were their conversation? Then we do it after that scene, but only briefly. And basically yeah. Mobius says, like, yeah, I'm not interested in that. It's like, okay. And that's really yeah. all I had to draw from that episode anyway, because it's the stuff that I feel like was still could be used, it's just they're not doing a very good job of it. The rest of it, like, trying to generate a plot out of this absolute mm -hmm. soup is, uh... Is difficult. That's it why I mentioned that man. lady because I think one of the one compliments I can give the first season is like I kind of felt something during her arc just for a split second. The idea of when she realized that it was all a lie, she actually took action and she wanted to find out the truth. And when she told Sylvie that she saw her life and she looked happy, I was like, oh my god, I kind of kind of feel something for a second. I hope this lady like figures this out. I just like the fact that she once she got the answers, she took action. And where's that character now? She's just an NPC in the background doing nothing. I thought she was actually going to have some agency. So they realized they were starting to prune all these or grenade or whatever the fuck they used. They realized used. They, they were doing what they've been doing since infinity. I know. Yeah. And now they were like, oh no, we have they to stop them. They realized it was God. business as usual. Yeah. But then yeah. they were like, oh, we need to stop them. And only Loki, Sylvie, and Mobius go. Like no one else is going to go there, teleport to where they are. They've been building this TVA thing. It's like this big organization, but it's always those three solving all the problems. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like nobody else works here. That guy gets it way would, too much screen time. The, it the would go a long way years. to have a wider cast of TVA characters instead of going back to the same two people over and over and over again. Um, yeah, different takes. Especially because, yeah, you could get their perspectives on what's happening with the time stuff and what they're doing and what the point is. And As, mu as, much, as, I, as much as I hated um, the, the character, Renslayer kind of provided that in the first season where she was different from all the other ones, where at least you got different perspectives from each pe person. It just feels like everyone has the same personality in the TV now, and there's like four of them. If you had a show where they were going to all kinds of different places... Like Guardians of the Galaxy, one of its big strengths, I think, is all the cool places that they go to. If they had 
them going in the show to all kinds of crazy places all over the cosmos. And then one of those places was just a 1970s McDonald's. It would feel oddly far more fitting and it would be really cool that, oh, th this one's actually, this one's on earth in the 1970s. And it would mm. feel more appropriate that the randomness just kind of put them there instead of, oh, we're on earth again. It's yeah, but like, Earth is uh, the most important place in the MCU, especially with Marvel. You have all of these wacky places on the mm -hmm. cosmic side that you could visit, but you just don't. Just seems weird. Part of the reason I feel like we should be hypercritical of specifically Star Wars and Marvel, because both of these are like, the potential for ideas is limitless. You can do whatever the fuck you want and you do nothing. You know, it would probably serve them well to do that because they could reference places in the comics and you can put that in the trailer and get people mm -hmm. hyped up about the possibilities even though it probably won't amount to much <laughs> so the way that they write these projects. But it seems like it would make sense if you visit locations from the comics that are in different places in the universe. Mm -hmm. That'd probably be something of a selling point for the show. They give them fan um, points for every little thing that they do. Well, so they gave them points for... Uh, uh, they were passing her like arms. two or three seconds <laughs> in uh, Multiverse of Madness when they were going through all those different universes. Oh, like, shit. even seeing those places for a couple of seconds got you something. So imagine yeah. you had a whole episode that was set in one of these locations. This show would be an acceptable framing device to go to a lot of places that we've been to across the universe as well. Such a strange experience with these shows. Like, you'd think, um... Yeah. Secret Invasion, one of my big things with that was, like, it just... Shapeshifters is one of the coolest things you can do in a story, and, like, you guys had no ideas for it. They like, do I nothing just, with I, it. Yep. I'm tired of sci-fi having well, no like creative sci-fi ideas. They're opening like, scene yeah. being like, everybody's a scroll, but not you, Fred. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> like, There's a boyfriend that I trust that. deeply with everything. I can't wait to tell you about all those crazy shapeshifters out oh there. Oh my god, Boy, yeah, that's tell you. so stupid. What a shitty start. Well, and, and just matter information, right? It's like seeing, um, I don't forget his name, Bilbo, new Bilbo. Bilbo. Martin Freeman. Yeah. Seeing Martin him, Freeman. you're like, great pretty Bilbo. sure he's not in the whole season, so this is just a meme, like a, like a, he's gonna be a scroll. he'll be killed or something, mm -hmm. and that'll be that. There's just it's no truly, layered right and ever with this stuff. That's what I mean, like, we have the same in this, right? The, the, the single dimensional sort of, Loki, don't do it, and then it's like, haha, oh, turns out that was just a ploy. Remember how he said, you're a good actor? It's like, no, I'm an analyst, because he did some <laughs> acting, see? <laughs> the opportunity for suspense with Loki, they're just pissing it away, because you just, we don't believe him anymore. I'm just like, that's not you. Like, you don't actually enjoy it anymore. It feels like they're trying to tap into that now, because, like, maybe the people who complained about the first season, but it's just not believable anymore. That's why I was saying this feels like like the real Loki doing like a cosplay of like the old Loki, like pretending to be himself, but that's not you anymore. You're soft. Yeah, it, it does feel like they're wheedling in a little bit, like, hey, you know, we remember who this guy is. Yeah, or was. Like, you like Loki, right? You like this guy, right? But we can't have him be that way anymore. But we'll tease yeah, him like Because remember, he's an evil you know? villain. Loki would have tortured Brad in the first scene and gotten his answers, and the show would have been over right there. The episode but. sure would have been shorter. And you could even <laughs> do it without showing it. You can do the whole, like, Mobius Loki says, uh, you know, give me just, I just need 10 minutes alone. That's all I need. And then he's like, you cannot hurt him in a permanent way. And Loki's like, I won't. And then we come back, and, you know, it's on the actors, of course. But Brad just could cut. look absolutely terrified. When we come back, yeah. I always reference Reservoir Dogs. The you know which which um we've seen them talking about the torture scene. Stuck in the middle with you. Yes, yeah, yes, you know, I know. You don't even really see a lot of it. It's mo. It's just more so the performances, the music, the screaming, and the way they they shoot it. You don't need to show everything, but if you have creative ideas, you can do torture scenes and such. It's one of my favorite ones. And like, if they're not willing to like have that those type of teeth, at least have the creativity to give us the illusion of violence, but they, everything has to be so soft and so nerfed. And even if they like, if they acted enough with a serious threat, that would have been like, you can have just threats that are really dark. Yep. You know, like here's yeah. what's gonna happen. Give them the speech of here's all the things I'm going to do to you. So tell me now and I won't have to do them. That's a lost art form. Like the villain that can torture. Like, I agree. Yeah. True mm -hmm. base. Torture well, remember, overall. Secret Invasion like, actually did it properly, but it was because they had other goals, not because they were trying to make a good torture scene. They, they actually had to get her to get the information out of him quickly. And they needed her to confirm he was a scroll, which that was not the best way to do it. But it kind of works in terms of fighting that out and giving a very credible threat to the kind of damage you're going to do. Remember, he even, he even stood by with, after losing a finger in that until she made his blood boil with some kind of injection. Yeah, that one, yeah. that would be one of the ones I'd reference for a uh, decent modern. Yeah, isn't it crazy though? It's like, oh, you did yeah. that right in and among in the all same that show, terrible shit. But, they, but having someone who can get the answers just by, like Rags was saying earlier, just 
with their mystique and like just the words the that they use, intimidation. just the threats and intimidation, just being able to do that and make it convincing. We don't even get to the violence. I miss someone who can just get the job done and like really command. It's up, just competency. Like, command I'm. Yeah. We love it when we watch these shows and we just see someone who's good at their job because yes. it seems to be such a rare thing these days yes. that someone's yes. just yes. competent. That is Loki season two episode. That's Loki, two. everyone. Loving yeah. it. Great stuff. Yep. Excellent. Like, nope. Fucking yeah, sense. I think. I, I wonder if this is going to be the kind of one that when we're through it, we'll just be like, huh. oh, well, there okay, it goes. That happens. That was, that was a thing. I doubt that I'll happened. ever think about that again. Kind of like Ahsoka, but Ahsoka yeah. annoyed me more with its boredom. Oh, yeah. I don't know if this one will get there. We'll see. Because I kind of like the actors. There's not been much <laughs> no. story yet, so bear that in mind. Be That's more. true. Yeah, there hasn't been they're gonna old. go nuts. No I, wonder I they're like just gonna keep this pace and then just go crazy. No wonder they release like four episodes to critics or whatever. It's like, because if they already had two, it'd be like, what are they gonna say about this show? Nothing's happened really. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Good night. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. See you later. You lose. You loser. Damn it! He got me. What'd you bring me?